So to my brown sugar in my little whatever you want to call this, I have brown sugar in here. I'm going to add garlic, I mean onion powder, smoked paprika, cayenne. You really want some heat up in there. Some black pepper. Oop, making a mess. Some salt. You can go a little heavy, not heavy, but equal amounts with the salt because you do have brown sugar down in there. You're going to put some Scotch Bonnet hot sauce down in here. Use whatever brand that you prefer. Because of the sugar and the amount of chicken that I'm making, this will not be too hot. I'm also going to use some chili oil just to get it to turn into a paste. And it's going to bring some flavor to your meat. Mix this up. And we're gonna slather our chicken. All right guys, so I have my chicken thighs in my bowl and I added my spice mix. I'm gonna mix this up and allow it to marinate for about two hours. And yeah, and pretty much I'm gonna bake this off and halfway through I'll add the broccoli to the skillet and continue let it continue cooking. So mix this up and allow it to marinate. All right guys, so this is what it looks like um, after I rub the seasoning all up in there. And I'm just going to allow it to marinate. Alright guys, so I'm going to pop my chicken into a 400 degree oven. And I'm going to cook this off for 40 minutes. And then I'm going to toss my broccoli just right down in there. And cook it another 20 minutes. And then that will be it for the chicken. Alright guys, so this is what the chicken looks like so far. It looks amazing. It's nice and caramelized because of the brown sugar. Now you're just going to take your broccoli and just, you know, strategically drop it here, there, anywhere. The chicken already basically caught up on his, its color, so it doesn't really matter where you put it. But if you can find a spot that's not directly on top of the chicken, that would be great. And I'm going to pop this back in the oven for another 20 minutes so the chicken could completely cook through and the um, broccoli will be nice and tender. And I'll show you guys exactly what it all looks like. Alright guys, so this is what it looks like. Um, the broccoli is nice and tender. The chicken is nice and golden and cooked through. So basically I'm going to eat this maybe with some squash or even some more veggies. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick and easy recipe, and I'll see you next time on my next video. Bye, guys.